Hello everyone. Good morning. I'm Varun. In this demo, I would like to show a Spring Boot security application along with crude operations. Basically, I've integrated Spring security with the crude operations. What is the meaning of this? This is an application which I've built wherein a user can perform, create, update and delete of the users. So before adding security, this application can be accessed by anyone using the URL. I want to control this or I want to restrict this. Now the condition I've kept is only a valid user with a password can log into the application and perform the create and the perform create update and delete operations if the user is not registered then he has to create an account for himself register himself the the user who is registered the details will be stored in the mysql database and then he can perform the operations Okay, let me show a small demo of what I'm talking. This is my application. Whenever I enter the URL followed by the login page, first a page displaying the username password will be present. Now, for example, I do not have a user ID password. Let's see what will happen. When, I, when the user ID password is not present in the database, it says your username password is invalid. So this user, whatever user ID password I have entered is not present in the database. So I have to first register or create an account. So I have to click, I'll click on the page, create an account. Here I'll give a username. See Kirtana CPV and I'll give a password. Okay, the password it will ask you to confirm and it should be same as the one you entered above. Okay, so this is the username and this is my password and this is confirm password. I'll say submit. So now the user is registered and it has allowed the user to log into the application. Now let's see, let's log out and here you can see the name of the user. Welcome Kirtana CB. Now let me log out once. When I click on this log out, it gives a message you have been logged out successfully. Let me try to log in with the same user ID password which is Kirtana CBV. And the password so you are able to log in let us see what will happen if I give any of the username or password wrong I'll give the username correct and the password wrong okay. I've given the password wrong let's try to log in it says your username and password is invalid. So this is my application. Now let me log in. I'll log in and if you see this application, uh, I've already built this application. What uh, it basically a application performing crude operations, which is create, update and delete of the students. If I click on this enroll new student, it will take me to the student enrollment form. Here I've given the form validation. Say if I don't enter anything and click on register, I'm get I'll get an error. It says the size must be between 3 and 20. So I'll enter some details here. Okay. Country India, male, postgraduate, and I'll click register. 
so this user is added now i want to edit any of the existing users i'll say i'll edit now the i'll say edit and i'll click from graduate to post graduate and i'll click edit now you can see this section so i'm able to edit similarly if i want to delete uh, okay let me delete the last user id let me delete this so it has deleted this user id so this is my application with security now if i click on this delete all students it will delete all the pages at which i don't want to press now because uh, if i click on this link all the students will be deleted so this is the application which i will show in this demo i have already built a crude application to which i will integrate my security uh, page or the security operations so let's proceed with the demo